Drawing and painting are, are related, but they're different mediums altogether. Drawing is fast and, and temporary in a way, and uh, you can, you know, you mess it up, you just start another drawing. <laughs> As I started out with two figures on this painting, I had one figure and I thought I didn't really like this pose that I had, it looked too melancholy. So I, I kind of scratched that and then I went to two figures and I didn't like these figures, I thought they looked. So then I kind of stumbled on the dog and, um, and then I have some magazine pictures of dogs and that helps me with dogs since I don't have a dog, but um, uh, I need to try to catch a personality of a dog. And, and which way the legs go. They're kind of hard to draw. I tend to like brushes that are more um, square on the end rather than uh, rounded, but rather than the filbert shape. I, I don't know, I just don't really like the, um, the marks that these make as well as I like the blunt mark. Um, so I think I'll start with this one. So what I'm trying to do here is just get more paint on this canvas. So it's mainly to capture the spirit of the moment of being at the beach. It's not trying to say anything super political or um, anything like that. It's more um, just to be a moment. And I think that's okay. I don't think art always has to be about a bigger social commentary. I like the process of having the painting sort of come out of all of this mark making without me necessarily doing it. I mean, I mean, I mean I'm doing it, but I'm not necessarily thinking about it. It's more um, intuitive, I guess, than deliberate. I, I feel like I'm always learning and, and that I, I like to try different things. So I've, I've, I've gone through phases where the figures are more broken or more, um, lifelike, more exact, um, or where they are exaggerated, like the heads are too big or the, the hands are too big or there's three hands or there's, I don't know, something that, that isn't necessarily natural, but maybe it, in paint you can do that. In photography, you, you can't. So I, I guess I like the freedom of being able to manipulate the subject matter without using a computer like you have to in Photoshop or something like that with photography. Which photography, I, I use photography as a source a lot. If I can see something, I can usually draw it. Whereas if I, I just have to imagine it, it's, it's usually more um, fanciful or it's not exact because my memory of, of how something looked is not photographic. So I, I then kind of go with it from there. But if it's if a photographic source, then tends to look more like a photograph.